Well, hello everyone. And Cherry Garden here, back with another Plan B Terraform. Now, off camera, I set up a couple, some smelting areas, I guess you call them. Um, now, I had this set up a bit differently. Like, I had basically all these chained in one long thing, and then having all the factories chained off of that. And the problem is, it doesn't work that way. Because, from my calculations, basically, this produces 15 per annual per cycle. This uses three per cycle. Uh, or three, um, it produced 30, right? Um, so just because of the way that it kind of works is it's, it's going to be using annual production is 30, but it uses three every 30. So uh, I don't know how exactly how to explain it, but it takes three. So basically you need three of these to, for one of these. And that's basically how I did it. But I don't think it's exactly accurate because this is, these are full. But it doesn't matter because they are being used and that's irrelevant again the they kind of con, con, <laughs> confuse me a bit the ratios because it's like this one produces this many but it doesn't consume this many but anyway we have a, a steel smelting area down here we have iron ore down here we have steel bars and then here we also have mechanical parts both sides and again this is just to get some stuff set up and then here i'm making tons of rails we are up to over a thousand at this point four trains are making tons of rails you can make eight from one and one you get eight rails which is pretty good and then over here i obviously have the sulfur and i have the concrete being made and as well as i have a couple of these things which is basically well, actually i don't need that one because i have sulfur and concrete being made here and again these are all chained together and then these are chained together so basically this whole setup is producing you know two forms of regular concrete now what we got to do is we have to get the reinforced concrete going up to here because if you remember at the end of last episode we actually lost a bunch of people and reinforced concrete is still the problem so what we have to do is first things i want to do is i want to double these up and these will chain together uh, i think if i put it if i put one here i see i want to get the reinforced concrete to kind of come down to here uh, and then if you delete something you do lose population so that is not a good thing uh but it's okay so reinforced concrete is going to be here now i want to get rail lines going now, i haven't used rail lines before but it, it basically is the same kind of concept i think we're gonna have a couple straight lines here and then oh, that going the wrong way obviously so we'll come and we're gonna go straight down this way come on better if it would snap a bit better but that's okay and then what i want to do is i want to bring a rail line i wish there'd be an in in between here it be something like that and then is that gonna line up are we gonna get locked out uh no we weren't locked out you will not luck out we're one off which is fine the lead to basically just hover and just click and drag which is so easy to delete things so great so great straight okay so here what we're gonna do here is we have steel and we have concrete so we need to make well, we have reinforced concrete i should say and that's or excuse me we have mechanical parts here and we have reinforced we have regular concrete here so what we need to do is make reinforced concrete and that's made, of course, in your assemblers. So what I want to do is I want to set my assemblers up, I think, right here. And I can just do, whoops, we have to go to, where are we at here? Oh, not assemblers again. I always, I always get confused about which is the right one. So we're going to do reinforced concrete. So I want to do this. I just want to drag a bunch like this. And the way you can get around, well, well we made this is really easy. So basically, to put the MK2, you put these. This is going to be concrete. We like every other one. And then this one up here is going to be, um, this one up here will be the, uh, where's the steel bar? Then you middle mouse button, you go do, do, do. And that's all you really need. So what we're going to do is we want to bring steel, which we have, we can really bring it from right here. We bring it down by a truck. We're going to go straight down. Doesn't matter which one we go to. This is perfectly fine. And we have tons of trucks. I don't know how many trucks are here. We actually have 19 trucks. We don't actually have that many, do we? And this is going to bring down, um steel bar and we're going to do 10 trucks yeah because we're, we're making trucks they're just not being made very quickly uh, which is obviously the problem uh, as well so we actually have some concrete being made here so we'll piggyback off of that up to I want to bring it to the middle one something like that would be fine and then we'll grab another truck here and we're going to go right to here and this is going to be concrete and we're going to do 10 trucks so if you shift left click um, it gives you 10. Uh, obviously, I backed off one. So we should now be making um, reinforced concrete. Now, the problem, though, well, not a problem at all, is we actually have to put these now, which this is going to be reinforced concrete, which is going to be here. 
every other one because these will jump together and then I want to have one central one um, I guess would be here and there and this would be the central location here reinforced concrete and the reason why I want to do it like that is because I want to bring the rail line straight across where's our rail line at and I got to bring it down from here now rails are why did it dip like that that's weird kind of what that's oh you know why it's because of the it's because of the map is round right so every so often you have a bit of a hiccup here where the way these fit together um Dyson Fruit Program is a, is a perfect example of that. See how it, it kind of doesn't, it's a bit wonky like that. It's because you must be on a meridian line where it actually changes the size of these things. Because as you get closer to the bottom, they're, I'm not sure if they're actually smaller, but it looks like that way. But it doesn't matter. So what we have here is we have some train. So we're going to grab a train. What's the hold up here? What? Oh, it's iron ore. No wonder. I'm so dumb. Never mind. We're going to do this. And I'm going to do that. And then we're just going to jump all these together. Uh, like that. There we go. Now they'll start working. I'm like, why is it not working? That's why. Because they weren't they weren't jumped together. I was going to the ore. Uh, and then I think I did the same thing here, didn't I? Um, no, this is fine. We have two more trucks here. It's a little bit farther away, so... But what we want to do then here with the reinforced concrete, we, I mean, we have tons of rails right now. We're just pumping out ridiculous amounts of them. But we'll need them. We're at the three, or no, we have 1,000. So we're going to go our locomotive, which is going to go here. And then we got to pick the end one. Is going to go all the way. Where are we at here? All the way. Come on, come on, come on. Up to here. And it's going to go there. Wait, what? Hold on. That didn't work. Why didn't that work? Did I not select the right thing? Oh, it won't let me put it there. Oh, right, because they have to form loops. They have to form um, loops. They can't. Uh, they can't end. That's why they have to have loops at the end. Uh, I forgot about that. Forgot. Probably tells you here that. Oh, it doesn't actually tell you, which is interesting. So what we'll do is we have to just bring this. All right. What we'll do is we'll just delete a couple of these. We'll do this, and we'll bring a loop like this. There we go. That works. I think I think that would that should work. Let's try it out now. If that will work or not. Um, this obviously can't be here. I would delete that. This sh this should work. I think it will work. I should be able to click here. Yep, that works. Yep. Okay, good. Because it needs to have an up and back. We're going to zoom in on this one, and we're going to dump this off right here. Doesn't really matter which way it goes, does it? I want it to kind of go that way. This is going to be reinforced concrete. Perfect. And we're going to do two trains. I just want to see what these trains... Did it go already? No, I'm like, there's no way it went already, did it? Because we have to get our population in the middle city back up and... At least back up to a 1,000. Oh, there. Oh, look at that. Oh, my gosh. Look how big that is. Oh, no. This is the... What? What the heck? Look how big that train was. What the heck? How is it jumping to there? That's three, though. What the heck? That is so big. How the, how the heck does it load the whole... Th what? Look how big that train is. Oh, my God. How many cars is that? Well, let's just pause it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15 cars. Holy jeez. But as soon as it hits here, let's just follow it up. Wow, that is a ma I don't know how fast. How could you load it faster? I guess by having... Oh, I know why. You have multiple depots. I just want to see what happens when it hits this. Should be coming up pretty soon. There it comes. I just want to see what happens when it gets to this. Like, does it stop? you think it would stop, right? It, it just slows way... Because it should unload everything. Oh, yeah. That's exactly what we're looking for. Look at that. I wouldn't actually need this one then, would I? Is it going to get all of them? I mean, theoretically, it should. And then it should go fast again. Yeah, okay, cool. Now we should be back up to over a 1,000 soon. Let's just pump this up. Yeah, there we go. Okay. So now as long as we keep this at a good rate, 
this population will not dip down. Because the issue before, if you remember, we, we had to hit a thousand population. I mean, we still unlocked these things, but it was giving us a negative impact. So now we're at least bringing in what we need. We have tons of auction. This, this town is good to go. Now, I'm not going to ramp up any more production of anything down here at the moment. How many more? Of the, how many of these things do we actually have built? 30? I think that's plenty. Just delete it. All right. This seems to be working out okay. Uh, we're making reinforced concrete. You're making... Uh, why is that one here? I don't want that. That's not the right one. This is steel bar. This is concrete. Oh, it is. Oh, so, so concrete is a bit kind of slacking a bit. We can go up. Uh, we can go up to sixteen. I guess. Okay. So what we got to do though is to continue on. Of course, is we want to get the next objective, which is reach a population of two hundred in our next biggest city. Or how? All right. This is still. All right. We're starting to level out now. This is obviously way leveled out. We have to get the 200 population. Yeah, we have a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff I still want to do here. I'm just not. Oh my gosh, what happened to? Oh, because we're actually out of sulfur. Shoot. All right, let's just do a quick um, pause. Let's just bring in all the sulfur. So that can stay there. Let's just delete all this. Wow. Okay. Well, we have to go back to kind of our not our drawing board. We're gonna do um, sulfur. Wow. Okay. So if we jump it like this, right, this is going to be perfectly fine for what we're doing. And this needs sulfur, right? It needs sulfur. So what we would do is you put extractors in, basically just um, line them up like this, line them up like that. And then down here is the same thing. And then we can put one, every other one, because again, these will jump two tiles. So something like that would be perfectly fine. Um, this will also work. Oops. Even if I want to jump it a little bit more as I put one there, we can cover some of that. And then we want to do like that. Now that theoretically, that should work. And they should all jump together. Jump or hook together, however you want to call it. Yes, look at that. And the thing is the way that the they way that the depots work is they, they wanna they want to equalize. Now it's hard for them to to equalize, but they want to equalize. Okay, we're we're doing fine now. We're pumping it out like crazy right now. Yeah, this is fine. I do want to do is I I want to make these a couple bigger ones so make them bigger because you get two actually I want to I want to make all of them bigger ones because you get two helicopters per thing I guess you call per one um, same thing with this here actually this these are doubles already oh wow look how much we're going oh my god we're going through this fluoride this uh what's it called Laura, like crazy too. Okay, so population is staying pretty even now. What we got to do is we got to work on our next area, our next biggest city, which they're both the same. We need is is basics. We're back to basics again now, right? Uh, we only have three cities. We have New Singapore and we have um, Suz Su Hao. So these are kind of here, and then what's this one? This one's yeah. I want to go with this one. So we got to get population two hundred. So what we got to do is we need. What do we need for for this one? Well, we, let's put down a supply center. Remember the supply centers from way back when? We only have one left. Uh, we need concrete, basically. So what we got to do is we can either train it in, or what would make more sense is probably just to make make more concrete right here, really, right? Um, so let's get our first road in. Uh, try to keep things a little bit kind of nicer looking. Um, I'm not sure why it doesn't like automatically make a straight line, but that's okay. See if you kind of tail it up like that, you can kind of get close. And then I want to go like this straight across. Perfect. So we want to make concrete though, right? So let's just kill a couple of these off. So the way, you know, because we have the MK2 uh, depots, we might as well do, you know, use them properly. And I basically want to just kind of scatter. Oh, that's too far away. Yeah, these are too far away. You can only jump two squares. So we do something like that that should be able to that should be able to fill the whole area now if you click off of it it won't work obviously there we go that's the whole area done so from that we want to make um, concrete basically right so what we want to do is we want to get a couple um, 
factories in here. So if we do make my concrete, if we jump this to this, and we do this, 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 and what we'll do here is we'll put one of these, and this one will hold the concrete like that. Because this will reach all of these, and this will reach all of them, and this will obviously reach all of them as well. So what we gotta do is we gotta go back into our trucks. We have tons, we have not tons, we have a lot of trucks, more trucks again. So we're gonna dump this right into here. We're gonna go right into uh, concrete, and what we gotta do is we have to put a depot, or a depot, if you will, uh, right here, and this is gonna accept concrete. And there we go, so let's just, let's just fire this up quick. Because this shouldn't take very long. Um, what's the problem with this our big city again? Are we lack? What are we lacking? We should always be lacking something. Are we seriously lacking reinforced concrete already? Oh my gosh! I can't believe how much reinforced concrete we're using. Oh, but here comes a whole huge load of it. Look at this. Oh my gosh! Is it unloading the whole thing? It's not. Oh wow! How do you? Hold on. How do you? Can you set this? What is that? Remove all transport lines. Oh wow, you can't, okay. So we should actually probably just do four then because it doesn't unload everything. I wonder how to make, how you actually make it. Oh, you know what? I bet you do something like that. Cause there's more, there's more things now for it to unload. Ah, I bet you that's how we do it. Okay, how are we doing here, my friends? Are we making concrete yet? I must be missing, I think I'm missing something. Oh, we don't have enough trucks. That's a problem. There we go. 20 trucks. Again, we could use a rail line, but we don't really need to use a rail line. So I'm going to wait for these trucks to come. As soon as they start coming, this should go pretty quickly, I, I would think. Well, I know. Here they come. Here they come. Non-stop. Well, not non-stop because it'll come in waves, which again is perfectly fine as well. Um, if we have another one of these, we can unload it twice as fast. And I mean, this is there's a, there's a certain speed this goes at, right? But as you see, we're at a speed or a demand of 10. And we can't go any faster. But we should start kicking this over any second here. Um, the population, there we go, we're at 4. I mean, you can't make it go any faster. But the thing is, every time you get a new population, the demand goes up. We're at 14, we're at 15. This is going up. I mean, it's going slowly. It'll go in waves, right? How are we doing temperature, by the way? We're kind of leveling out with that stuff, which is fine. Um, yeah, we can't really go any faster. Can we get another line going somehow? Um, no, we just need more trucks. Let's just do 30 trucks. Why not, right? I mean, this is a good setup here. Like, we're not, these aren't even being used. But eventually, as things run out here, these other ones will, will, will take over. Which is why it's a good, good way to have this. Because everything's equalized. They'll only equalize so much, you know? Alright, trucks are pumping it in like crazy. This should, this should not take very long at all. Um, <clears throat> can only go so fast. Oh, we already hit it though. Look, we already hit what we need to hit. So let's cut this way back because now we need to make oxygen. And guess how we make oxygen? By oxygen, ox atmospheric generator. So what we got to do, this should actually be pretty quick. Put this to here. Oh, this is going to hold, um, oxygen. I always forget that it does that. Oxygen, right? So what we want to do is we want to take the atmosphere. Yeah, we'll keep it at that. The atmospheric generator. Uh, which we have tons of we just want to go like this Dump this here and dip this here and what we want to do is we also want to get another one Which this one over here is now going to hold um, the carbon And that will work and we can go like this 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 and that and then that, and that. there we go So as these continue to pump and make things the oxygen will literally just be dumped right into this because watch As soon as they start making some it's going to go whoop and it's going to go right into this and there we go. So this actually is a pretty good way. We can speed this back up because I want to, we should be able to hit 200. I guess 10 was the first one. Then we have to do oxygen. And I guess 100 will be the next one. I'm not exactly sure. But this should not take very long at all because um, we have tons of concrete and the oxygen, like it can only do so much per, per annual, I guess, which only per tick, I guess, or per minute. I don't know how you would look at it. But it's going pretty quickly. We're at 15 already. We're in winter and summer, of course. We're at 17. Uh, it's the only problem is you can't make this go any faster. Basically, you can't. Uh, I like to click on that, and then it'll kind of just jump us around. So, yeah, the issue here is what? It's nothing. We're at 66 for 7 percent. So, we actually have tons of concrete, reinforced concrete, tons of oxygen. I want to just make another one of these just so we have a good backup of this. Um, actually, just make another one. So, wait a minute. Because it keeps dipping. 
Why would it dip below 67%? It says 100%. What? Wonder why it keeps dipping. You know what? It doesn't really matter, does it? I mean, the population isn't going down. It's just we're right on that edge of a thousand people here. And it, it, it is kind of dipping. It dips down, it goes up, and then it comes down. Because the annual supply is 70 feet. Yeah, like, we're doing okay with this. It just needs high tech parts, so it dumps it down to 37. Now it goes back up. So this is fine for what it is. It's, I'm not going to get too upset about this. This one is, is in the green 100%. Where is it at? Here we go. 100% in the green. Again, the cameras are a bit kind of crazy. Yeah, this is fine. We have tons of oxygen. Uh, we can even put more of these if we need to put more of these if we're like, overloaded, which we shouldn't be. But we're fine. Yeah, it's just, it can only go so fast. That's the only problem. Annual supply keeps ticking up, ticking up. So you can see here, we're kind of stuck with how fast we can go. Um because it can only take so many but look how fast this is growing we're gonna hit 100 and i think 100 will be the next threshold and we'll see what we need if we're 100. is it 100 the next one? Oh, it's not 100. okay good it's actually not 100 it's, it'll be 200 then it's good new Su Su's how we're going we're doing pretty good here guys um yeah this is the next threshold and then i'm not sure we're gonna wait to see what we get here so we're actually doing again you can't boost how fast this goes how's our our temperature is going up. It's not bad. We can go down to where are we doing this stuff at over here. Where are we doing the atmosphere stuff at? Are we are we like are we at, are we stuck somewhere? We're lacking fluoride because we basically tapped this whole patch. That's the problem. We do have do we have any more? Oh my gosh, we don't have any more around here, do we? We have a little bit over there. Do we have any big patches of that? Wow. Uh, no. Well, there's some there. Yeah, because we basically need um, sulfur, which we have tons of sulfur. The fluoride is the problem now. Oh, shoot. Okay. Where do we have any fluoride? There's anywhere close. We have some here. We could just truck that in, I guess, in the meantime, because we will need it. So we could probably just bring that. Um, we, we need to kind of wind it over to this. I think that's fine, and we need to bring it. This is just the this is just the raw fluoride, so we can literally just dump it uh, dump it there. And then what we'll do is we'll come over to here, and we'll get some depots going. I like to say depot is funny. So if we put one here, uh, this is just going to take fluoride. And we put one here, one here, here, here. That should be enough. I hate if you click off the wrong one, it won't actually place one. That should be it, right? They're all touching each other? Good. So if we bring some road action right about here, and we're gonna go to our trucks. We should have a bunch of trucks. Yeah, we do have a bunch of trucks. This is gonna come all the way down, all the way down, all the way down, all the way down. Wow, this is such a long road. Jeez Louise, what a long road that is. We're gonna do fluorite, and we're just gonna go 30 trucks because I mean it's, we're basically just jumping this into here so it's it's not a big deal it's fine and then um yeah it's just kind of it's fine I don't want to keep rigmarole in it because it's fine and we should be able to put another one here and another one there if we really want to this could be set up a bit better by having this these in the middle um but that's fine Actually, this could be out here, and then these could be back here. But again, it doesn't matter. I just want to see if it's pe petering out, if we keep going up. We can't really click on this. This is kind of... Well, this is the pressure, right? So having these raise the... Um, it raises... Let's see. It raises one or the other. You don't really... Well, you can only choose this, SF6, right? So this is fine. Um, which is what is reduced. This is the pressure is going up. So this, the temperature is a byproduct of that. So it can only go up so much. So we're basically at the threshold of this now um, per segment, I guess. I don't know how you want to explain it. And how are we doing with our other city over here? How are we doing? Are we, are we stuck? Oh, what's the problem? We are stuck somehow. Oh, because it wants reinforced concrete. That's why. Okay. So we're back to the reinforced concrete then. So, okay, fair enough. So what I want to do is actually um, get rid of the line. 
like that. I mean, the, the, the road stays, which is what you want. So now we need to make reinforced concrete. So that's a bit more of a challenge uh, because we have this here. So we have the concrete actually here, which is fine. And then we need to get some road action from here. Can we go right through this? I bet not, right? We have to go around, which is fine as well. So what we'll do is we'll just do this. These are kind of wonky roads, but I'm not going to fight over it at all. Not going to fight over it because we have to get this population, we have to get our population back up and running, back up and back up and running here, I guess you would say. This, we can just kind of dot these around here and we're going to go here and then maybe here and then here and then here and let's just put a bunch of extractors in. I wonder if there's like MK2 extractors. There gotta be, right? Something like that. Mm, let's see. This should hit all of them. That one won't. Okay. That's fine though. So what we want to do is we want to bring another road going, right? We have tons of trucks still, well, not tons, we have an adequate amount of trucks. So what I want to do is I want you to bring that right to here and we're going to deliver the iron ore to this and we're going to delete this road. So the iron ore is going to be delivered here, which is fine, of course. We're going to go, this is going to be iron ore. I should have just smelted it back there, but it's fine. I'm not worried about it. Dude, oh, no, 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 no. I want to do, this is going to be steel. Something like that, I think, is fine. And then, or actually, it's not fine. We have to delete this and this and this. And this. this is fine. The trucks, we got to do 20 trucks. And then this can go. This is fine. And what we'll do here is we'll dump this one here, which is going to be the steel bar. Dump this one here. We'll dump it there and we'll dump one here. No problem. Because then this should all touch and this should all jump to here, which we're at steel bars here. And then what we're gonna do here is let's just make another factory. If you say we just go, we need to make free and force, something like that. And then this one here is gonna be for the steel bar. So we're gonna go this and we're gonna go like that. And then what we can really just do is just do that, which would be easy enough. And this is do one more. All right, and then we're gonna do this here. This one here is gonna be the chauffeur. Um, or sorry, not the chauffeur, the, uh, the concrete. Concrete is going to go here, there, and there. And then what we're going to do here is we're going to take this one and go. This is going to be the reinforced concrete, of course. Here, here, here. And then reinforced concrete is going to end here and there. And then we'll run a road from here, there. And we're going to grab a truck. We're going to go from here. It's not very far. Well, I guess it's, a dec it's decently far away to here. And this is going to be reinforced concrete. And then what we'll do is we'll just delete these two because they don't need to because this will just jump to this and that's fine. Tons of oxygen, tons of reinforced concrete. So now we just had to bring in the actual concrete, which is going to be made um, right here. So we actually have to have actually we're not using the concrete. So we should be able to just um, bring this like that and grab a truck. And again, there's I'm sure there's more efficient ways to do this. I'm just trying to get the population that we need. Um, to where we need it. I guess it's basically what I'm trying to get at. So this should be perfectly fine. And here we're gonna dump, we'll do 10 trucks. This should be coming up any second, by the way. Here they come. And this will just churn out the, re the reinforced concrete and then we'll start trucking it up to here. Cause I want this population to, to hit 200 before we end the episode, because I wanna see what the next uh, the next threshold thing is. The next, you know, whatever you wanna call it. And the one down here, the the, uh, the other one we're working on, it's going to keep dancing between green and gray, or green and um, green and gray and and red because we don't have the other high tech parts that it needs, and that's fine. This is churning away quite well. This should tick over, not should not take very long. Yeah, because we'll hit what two hundred? Yeah, is that wreck good? Because supply needs to be a hundred percent. Where you won't have any growth. Here we're at, guys. I'm anxious to see what the next thing is going to be. Because it, it doesn't show, like, because the one we just unlocked gave us nothing. So I want to see what happens when we unlock the next one. That'll be the next cool thing. I'm going to stop it right here. And it should tick over any second. And three, two, one. Oh. We still didn't unlock anything. <laughs> Interesting, because it's like it's showing almost that we're. We don't have any waste, though. 
Wow, okay. So, like, it's showing, like, this. Like, the way that this looks, right? Well, that's less green, less green, less green, less green still. This one here... Interesting, because this... I thought this used to, like... Oh, it's just... Na oh, okay. It just naturally does it, no matter what when you're at. It just naturally... See, it naturally greens up. Okay, never mind. So, total population is 3,000. So, what we got to do is this will, this will take us to, I think, a population of three or 400. Well, we, we'll click on it here. We'll, we'll, it'll tell us. So, first one is 10. The next one is 10. The next one's 100. The next one is 350. So, we get 350 before we start needing um, the next level thing here. Because right now, we're at... You can't yeah you have to you can you click on it this way does it tell you how many people are in this one uh it doesn't tell you how many are in the city because there's no like button that you click on nothing is happening here of course there's no water um it doesn't tell you a total population which is kind of interesting but this will hit 350 but that does mean we have to come all where are we at here jeez louise all the way back here and we have to so the, this is working quite well these trains yeah, extremely well. But guess what? The next thing we have to start working on is what? High-tech parts. And if you remember, we can click back on this to go back. High-tech parts take aluminum and polymer. And polymer takes plastic waste or carbon. So we have a lot to work on there. Yeah, a lot to work on there. But, I mean, we're doing okay. Like, we have tons of aluminum here. But yeah, so what we got to work on is the high-tech parts, which we don't have. Like this is turning away basic stuff, which is fine. Like our main rail line or train line, which is fine. This is this is all like fine, generic, basic stuff. This right here, I think, is what are we making here? We're making how many locomotives? We have 48. Jeez Louise, way too many. So we are making. So we have high-tech parts being made. These are being made where? Very. So we have a very small factory of making these. Um, which is actually okay. This is trucking them where? To here. So what I want to do is I want to stop this route. And what I want to do is I want to take this route now to go to... Uh, I'm going to have to... Huh. Can I change where this is? If I change this to here that works that will work and then what we'll do is we'll delete this one this still jumps between everything which is fine this one can go high-tech parts this will be perfectly fine as well and what we'll do is we'll just we will hold on to grab a road here so the stops can literally go right in the middle of everything which is actually a good thing so we're going to go from here to here and this is going to be high-tech parts and we'll just do 10 trucks and then we have some high-tech parts here so we might as well use them or you know if you, if you don't use it you lose it right high tech parts and we'll just do 10 trucks eventually this will end end all right let's just keep this flowing i mean we definitely don't have enough to sustain this um because we're using a lot more than what we're making here but if i think if we if we dump these into here and this into here and this into here we should be able to make a couple more of these right the issue is this then. So the aluminum coming in is very, very small. And that's coming from where? All wow, it's coming from all the way down here, really. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. But we yeah, so the issue right now is we we don't have any aluminum. Okay. Fair enough. So I think what we need to do is uh yeah, we have a huge backlog. Okay. Fair enough. This is obviously pointless. That one's pointless. So this seems to be an MK2. Um, and then we can just do a couple. Uh, oh, hold on. I want to. This is going to be aluminum ore, right? So this is going to go here. Let's just see if we can kind of stretch this a bit. I don't know if it's going to work. Well, I mean, this part will work. It's just whether the other part will work. Then we do that. And then we just do this. So we have tons of ore coming in now. And now what we got to do is we have to start piggybacking the factories. So if we have to end here, so we can do this, can go here, 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 here. That should help. This one's defunct, so this can go away. 
this can go this can't go there because it's not going to reach all right these ones are defunct as well as you if you say so this one here can't reach anything so that one's fine this one can reach so all right we're producing more now we're just kind of being starved a little bit why are these not oh, they're not running because right because see how everything wants to equalize what happened we just put a, a couple of these here then it works a lot better all right we have tons now we have tons 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 now we have 30 trucks here 20 trucks here great all right we're working good now we've got to come all the way back here to get to the uh why is this going so slow by the way can we just like get this unloaded like seriously so i can kill this route I get all these unloaded. Actually, we can just go back down to ten. Maybe we'll just go down to five. Um, yeah, I think because it'll act. It use, all right, we have. Oh my god, we have tons of. All right, we're doing okay. We're doing fine now. Look at that. We're doing really, really well. Happy with that. This is producing more, which is good. So the issue now is still aluminum ore. So the aluminum ore has to still come in from where. We should be. It's coming in from all the way down here. We should be doing a lot better now. Because uh, we actually have a ton of aluminum ore. Yeah, we do. All right, let's just pump this up to 40. This one can stay at 30. Yeah, so if we do that in this, will they will they get fed? They do get they do go faster. Because again, each each depot I keep saying depot for funny to be funny, but it's de each depot can have two helicopters, right? So it can only do a maximum of a certain amount of jumps per turn or something, right? But we're actually doing quite well, I think. In terms of you know as long as this over here where's our other city at it's up here uh did we hit 350 we must have hit 350 because this looks like it stopped oh no we just need more reinforced what's the problem here my my dudes um the, the issue is what but steel what where's what's the problem with the steel we just don't have any and we have tons this is all jumping between. Yeah, we should just put another one here. It doesn't matter. Actually, you have to go there, right? Oh, no, that's actually not going to work either. It has, this has to go here for that to work. There we go. Okay. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do 60 trucks because why not? Like they're, it'll they'll get filled. Uh, that is not being being filled up is not the problem here. It's just the transport, which I mean, it's fine. Eventually, we're going to have like a huge bus system somewhere. I just don't know. We're not when we get to that point. I don't know. I want to get to the next the next goal to see if we unlock because the last you know, we the last two objectives, we unlocked nothing. Like we have to be getting into terraforming stuff at some point, right? Because our CO2, like our temperature is still uh, basically petering out now because this is petered out, right? Because remember what it said? It will only kind of go so high. And I think the issue is. Oh, no, we actually out of. Oh, it's because it won't it won't jump that far. Oh, I'm so dumb. That's why it didn't work. Oh, what a that was a bonehead move. I thought it was three away, not two away. All right, now we should start pumping. We should start pumping more out now. Oh, that was so silly. This one's gonna go there. This one's gonna go here. It doesn't really matter how how the trucks work. Uh, we have 15 and we have six. Uh, we could just go up to 10. It doesn't really matter. We have tons of trucks now. Yeah, that was the issue. Okay, because now the problem is these all have to go back, and then they have to all come back again. So uh, we can just do maybe 20, 50 trucks. Like, there's no limit for trucks, as far as I know. We should actually build another. So you have, if you build a couple more of these, the trucks will get loaded faster. Because there's naturally now we have six drones instead of two drones, so that's definitely more helpful. Sorry, right, so we should be good to go here. Um, is this going back up, or did it kind of peter out a little bit? Where are we at here? Um, this should reach there. Yeah, we're just waiting on the floor, the fluoride, the fluorite. We should be getting a huge truck shipment in any second here. I mean, hindsight, I should just move this down to here and just cut out all these middlemen trucks because this is, yeah, this is literally doing nothing right now. Let's, um, let's connect this road. Um, let's just delete this and what we'll do is we'll just get rid of this one and we'll just get rid of this one. And what we'll do is we'll just um, we'll continue this road to here. We'll get rid of. This. Let's. We're going to change that to go to um, here. That should work. We actually need to delete a bunch of this stuff. It all go away. This is doing absolutely nothing. Well, I guess it's doing a little bit. It's just we have to jump these. Yeah, we'll just jump them together. It's fine. 
Um, yeah, that's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Okay, let's, um, let's get extractors here. Let's extract all of this. So we can go to here, which is going to be the fluoride. Good. This is going to go to here. It's going to go to here. And then, I mean, yeah, this is fine. So what I want to do is just grab a truck like that. Then we'll grab a couple trucks. This one's going to go to here to here. We're going to do fluoride, and we'll just do 10 trucks just to use up. Because wherever there's a depot there or depot there, right? I know I say both things. Sorry about that. It's, I can't help myself. Um, it uh, This is actually a pretty big vein, isn't it? 400. It's just to use that. Because if there's a depot on top of a vein, it won't do anything. All right, these are pumping out again. I mean, naturally, they will. From a, yeah, okay, it's going back up. It's going, it's the, it's going, well, it's petering out. I think because we were just out of fluorite. Because it is going up. Because, I mean, at minus 30 C, nothing's going to grow. So maybe it's just waiting for the next one. But, I mean, I want to hit that next level, you know? Because it just says total population. Um, so this is, are we, are we lacking anything right now? Reinforced concrete again, reinforced. What's the problem here? The problem is I think we still have enough trucks. We also don't have enough trucks with the ore either. Are we having issues with ore? How are we having issues with it? Like we're pumping ore out like freaking crazy right now. No, we just need more trucks. 80 trucks. Let's just, I want a whole I want to have a wall of trucks going in here. Because that's the problem. It's just the issue is the trucks. 30 trucks. You need them to go faster, 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 faster. Yeah, here we go. We need to keep this will this city will grow to 350. And our other, our big city down here, we must be at a standstill again because it's not lit up green. No, we still are. I wonder why it's not lit up green. Interesting, because it's Hyderabad. Or Hyder, Hyderabad, Hyderabad, Hyderabad. I don't know why it's not lit up green. See on the mini map on the top right how the top one is in green? Because we're in, our supply is good. Our demand is good. Like, we're, we're running through this very well now i mean you would think the bar should still get to the end but i mean we're pumping out pretty good i don't know what the next threshold is before we well we put this it has to be three thousand. this city can't request well actually you know what it could because we have all this waste buildings we have these waste things that we have like we have the waste medical waste so oof that's we may have city waste can we recycle through so i mean but again if we if we produce waste it doesn't matter because all we'll do is we'll just store it We'll store until we can do something with it. Yeah, we don't have... We have recycling plants. I'm not sure what... Because we, we're not at 2,000 yet. Again, I wish it would tell you here how many... The population of... Just this town. But it doesn't It doesn't do that. As far as I know, there's no way to check that. We're at red... We're in the red now, which is not good. It's in green now. Let's just check to see what it looks like. Why is it in red? Oh, I know why, because we're going to be needing high-tech parts. We don't have it. So this is going to keep dancing between red and green. So as long as it doesn't stay in the green and the red too much, we should not drop population. But now our population literally just tanked. What's the problem? There's no problem. We're, we're, we're pushing through. It's just for some reason, it, it's to see how like it's not going up the population. I don't understand why it's not going up. Um, Cause like this bar should go full every time. Like if we go like that, does it go full all the time? See, it doesn't, like it keeps resetting itself, which is, I don't understand honestly, because is this getting, is, I mean, this should theoretically keep getting bigger. I just don't know how, cause you can't have two in one city. It won't work that way. Um, hmm. See our population right now is stagnant at 2003, but I don't understand. I don't know why it is because like this is totally full, like it's being used. Why is our population not going up? I wonder if it can't go up any higher. Like I wonder if we're maxed out at a certain amount here, which would make sense. But the question is then how are we going to get high tech parts up to this one? Oh, you know, we need reinforce. All right, this is where it keeps dancing between the two because this will jump back up. So I think what we need to do in the next episode, because we're, we're way over time, is we need to get a solid... Right? The oxygen is the easiest thing to make, right? We need to... Are we full on... We are full on carbon. So let's just load this up a bit. 
I mean, we're just having tons of carbon here. It doesn't really matter. Now, can we recycle, though? Hold on. Let me just see one. It's a recycler. That's waste disposal. Recycler. Concrete and high-tech parts. Recy well, this recycles the city's waste. This waste in the city to, to eva evacuate it. Oh, this is we're going to have to put one of these in the city, I bet. Mm, okay. Fair enough, fair enough. How are we doing with our... Yeah, this is still... It's still leveling out, which is to be expected, of course. Yeah, so our, our population is not going up because we need high-tech parts. Because I think we hit the, the, the upper level of the other one, which might have been... Well, if it's 350 and 1250, that's... Or 350 minus um, 2000 would be 1750. I think 1750 is the top population we can have. So we got to get some high-tech parts up here, but I mean, we're still lacking reinforced concrete, which the reason why is because we're lacking iron. And I think the issue is we have to start smelting iron down here. I think that's what we have to start doing, guys. So what we can do is we can start setting up some factory lines. Something like this. And we just, if we just kind of do, uh, that doesn't need to go there. If we do this. Is that jumping? Is that doing anything? That's going to do something. And if we do that and that, and then we do this, and then we do that and that and that. All right. And then we, if we supply, I'm just trying to do this quickly here. Steel bar, right? So we do this and this and this and this and this and that. They should all jump together. And now we should be able to just jump this together like that. All right. And then take some trucks which is going to be here and we run this all the way over to here and we go say this and we're going to do steel bar and let's just do 30 trucks and let's just cut this down to 60 trucks oh wait, no this isn't right um we need another one of these here that that'll work then that's fine because it'll come in and this will jump all the way across. It's a bit of a kind of a waste to do it that way. But it will still jump across. So it'll still be making some. Yeah, our population is not going to go any higher. Because we're stuck. Because the other city we have over here has a population of three. The other one has 1750 and the other one is 250. So that's that's our, our issue right now is we have to get high tech parts up to here. Now the question is, oh my god, how many rails do we have? We literally have 20 some thousand rails. We have to stop this. We have to stop this right now. We have to just stop this. And we have to stop this. We have we have like... How many do we have? 19,000 rails? Is that seriously what we have? Oh my god. That is insane. That is an insane amount. But we have high-tech parts. Where are they being made at again? They're being made up here, right? Nope. They're being made right here, right? Alright, so we have to bring a rail line from here... We need to bring it all the way up somehow up to here. And then we have to loop it around. That's really messy. And what we need to do is we got to put a depot up here. This is going to go here. And then this is going to be mechanical parts or high tech parts. Excuse me. It's going to go here. It's going to jump to here. It's going to jump to here. And then it's going to jump to it has to reach this. So if we jump it to here, and then we jump it to, actually, oh, uh, I'm just gonna delete this. I'm gonna delete this one. Jump this to here, and then jump this to here. There we go, that's high-tech parts, good. So we gotta go, oh, we're gonna do this really, really quickly, because we're gonna end up burning through all the high-tech parts, that is for darn sure. Let's just delete some of these. We have to do a little bit of a circle. Um, Nope. You have to have at least one loop, like one space in the middle where it will just join back up to itself. And we don't want that. Alright, I know we're way over time, guys. Um, but that's okay, because we want to go this. And we gotta get our train going. Where's our train? Come on, train. We have a 48 trains. Jeez Louise. It's gonna go here, all the way up to here. I want to go this way. This is gonna be high-tech parts, and we're gonna have two trains going. I just want to see what happens. I want the population to jump. I just want to see. I just want to make sure it works. Oh my god! Look at that. that's full already. Holy jeez. Yeah, we need to make some more. Like I mean, this is kind of like infrastructure where one builds on the next, on the next, on the next. But the train is is pumping along here. I just want to make sure if our population starts going up, 
then we're good to go and then we'll well we're going to end the episode anyway because we're way over time but i mean kind of like our our main reserves of things we have to really start because with monorails we could have this be all ore ore production we have these huge trains we're getting there guys it goes kind of right through the mountains well kind of clips through the mountains but that's okay high speed rail so it goes super super fast even if you just look at it in a regular speed or is it it goes pretty fast but what i want to see is how does it unload Oh wait, we have some here ready. What? We need this there. That's why. That's why it wasn't working. Here it comes. This is the second train then. It should theoretically the whole thing should get unloaded. Our population should start jumping really, really quickly. Oh, it doesn't get all of it. Okay. So that means we'll have to, have to do it like like that then. Pop this population should start jumping. I want to see this population go up. Once it starts going up then I know we're doing a good job. We have concrete, we have oxygen out the wazoo, we have this. Again, let's see, if we're gonna start jumping up, we should. Let's go to the next level. I want because it, it takes a bit for it to, like the demand, I don't know, again, it's the demand is kind of really stagnant right now. Which is very interesting, because you see how the bottom right, how the, the bar never reaches the end? But it's being used and we're at good. So the population should start going up. Hmm, that's interesting why it's not. I wonder if we have to start working on the other city. Because theoretically, we have everything we need. We have oxygen, we have reinforced concrete, we have high-tech parts. But the population ceases to expand. Hmm, I wonder why that is. Interesting, because there's no way we can get a thousand down. Oh wait, wait, wait! Now it's in the green. Oh, what's the problem? What was? Hold on. Why did this? What was insufficient? Oh, waste disposal. Interesting. You know, what, guys, we're gonna do a little bit. Oh, we we have to make. Ah, see, because I kept clicking on this. I need to click on that. Oh, if I messed up this whole time. I keep clicking on this. I want to click on that. So we need waste disposal. Well, guess what we have to make next? We have to make waste disposals, basically. <laughs> but you know, guys, we're way over time. Way, way, way over time. Uh, sorry for that. But I want to thank you guys for joining. We're having, having so much fun with this. Thank you guys so much for joining me. If you enjoyed the video, please consider leaving me a like as well as a comment. It would be much appreciated. And if you're enjoying this series especially or any other video on my channel, hit that subscribe button would really help me out to get to my next goal and you know what it's my bonehead move like the last like 20 minutes you've been spent because i kept looking at this it's pumping through this but this is what i need to click on because we need waste disposals we need to make waste disposals which is very very simple to make by the way you just make it you know i'm gonna make, it's gonna make them right here waste disposal can we literally make them in this no it'll be assembler right i'm doing this very very quickly very very quickly waste disposal okay good now we can make them. But we're done. We're done this episode, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you next time.